What's happening? I'm back and I'm gonna give you an Aspothra deck list that is gonna help you move up the ladder. Let's go to the deck list. So one of my favorite cards is gonna be Aspothra EX with the Dazzling Gaze ability. Your opponent can only attack if they add an energy to their attack cost. This is gonna cost so much disruption for a whole bunch of decks. And the more energy they add, the bigger amount of damage Espothra does. Hitting for 30 times all the energy combined on your active Espothra and their active Pokemon. And to disrupt them even more, I added in a couple eerie. Look at their hand and take out two items that are important to their deck. But before you do that, let them build up a huge hand and play Hand Trimmer, knocking their hand down to only five cards. So you wanna do the Hand Trimmer first, let them keep the items that they want, and then Eerie, and knock them down to three cards, taking their items. And then we got a couple Iono, Boss, and of course, the Aspect Prime Catcher. I started with the Hero's Cape, but Prime Catcher is so powerful. And then I got a Pal Pad to get some of these Eeries and Ionos back. And you want to go second because we do play Evolution to try to get a Zatu and an Espathra right on turn one going second. And another important card is going to be the Rigid Band. Bumping the HP on their first attack to 290. So the only way Giratina is going to hit you on its first attack is going to be if it has 3 energy, 10 in the Lost Zone, and Star Requiem. Even to do the Lost Impact, they need 4 energy. Charizard's gonna need three, but they're not gonna be able to knock you out until you've taken a whole lot of prize cards, and by adding that energy, they're just helping you out. This has gotta be my favorite deck right now. So let's go see it in action. Another future box. All right, what do we have here? We have an artisan to go get, I gotta get a flittle first, right? And do the attach, cause that's a like worst case scenario. Do the Ridge of Band and leave it there. All right, let's see what we got here. Got to see what we got after this. Yeah, we don't have much. Uh, Counter Catcher's not going to be active. Hand Trimmer's probably not going to be. A Colrus? Oh, this is not future. They just, they got unlucky by starting with the leaves. Yeah, definitely. I think they got unlucky. This is Lost Box? It's got to be Lost Box. It is. Okay. The good thing is that hand trimmer is going to come in so handy. I mean, this is the matchup. Uh, all right. So I can't palpate. There's nothing palpate. I can't counter kit. I could hand trimmer, but I really want to use that when they have like 15 cards. So I think I, oof, this is tough. Let's see what cards they got here. Temple Sinnoh, two Jet are gone. Okay. So that's already three because they chorus. They put the Giratina down. Hopefully that's it. The problem is I can only play one card, maybe two. And I'm going to save this hand trimmer. That is going to stay in my hand for as long as I can. I would really like an Eerie? No, Arvin. Of course, Arvin. I need the Arvin. Because if I get an Arvin, I, I might be able to switch. Okay, there's one switch gone. Another flower selecting. That's going to lead them to four. Jeez. They're having a heck of a turn here. I got to get them to like... 12 and then hand trimmer eerie that would be amazing let's see what happens jet and now they're gonna abyss seeking they're gonna be at six on turn one holy cow yeah this is not good they got eight they got eight now if if i get an eerie all right ultra ball all right let's see what we're gonna do here we're gonna artisan we're gonna artisan for uh well, they don't have Greninja, so we're going to do Natu. We're going to keep the Hand Trimmer. We're going to get rid of these two. And we're going to go get another Flittle. Flittle. We're going to get another Flittle. Okay. We're going to restart. And for two. Ooh, I do get a Zatu and a thing. And we're going we're gonna to retreat. And we're going to... Do I do the Hand Trimmer? <sighs> do I do it now or do I do it next turn? Let's do it. Let's do it next turn. There's 90 because they, they have to get out of the active, right? Because I could put these two down, restart. Hopefully this other card's playable. Uh, 
And then, yeah, that's, and, and then we'll take it from there. Holy cow. This is, uh, this will be interesting. They're going to chorus. Oh, we're going to hand trimmer. I would, I want that eerie so bad. I need the eerie really bad on this next turn because now they're up to 11. We have to survive this turn. Can we do it? They're at eight because the only way they can do it is use star requiem. Are they going to abyss seeking? If they abyss seeking, because now we're only going to hit for 120 unless we can find an energy. We can get the knockout. Oh, this is interesting. What do you have? You have 10 cards. You're about to get hand trimmered. Pass. Come on, Pat or Abyss Seeking. Abyss Seeking will get them to 10. They're thinking, do they not have a switch? And they retreat to go into Comfy, meaning they don't have a switch. They're going to get another card. They've already attached, so they can't go do an Abyss Seeking. Are they trying to find a V-Star? Maybe they don't have it. Oh, come on. I want to do Hand Trimmer so bad. Don't get anything. What's their next one? Mirage Gate. Oh, if they got rid of a Mirage Gate, they must have something bad. Because Mirage Gate would totally help them right now. Yeah, we're going to hand trimmer right after this. Come on, pass. Come on, pass. Pass. Radiant Greninja. No. Conceal cards. They're gaining more cards. I didn't get down mana fee. Is that what they were trying to do the whole time? They need a switch and two Mirage Gate. But they, they've already gotten rid of a Mirage Gate. And what's in the discard? No, no, not yet. Let's see what they have. And switch cart to another comfy. Oh, they're digging. Oh, I'm, I, I got to be able to use this hand trimmer. Come on. Let get, come on. Switch cart to what? Because you can't attach unless you abyss seeking. Greninja, they're going to Greninja me. No. I mean, that's two prize cards. Mirage. Oh, no, I didn't get down a, the mana fee. They're going to Greninja me. The good thing is we're, we're going to get down. Oh, and we're going to have to keep everything in our hand. All I'm going to be able to do is play Hand Trimmer. All right, here we go. There's one. There's two. They didn't even attach it. Do they have another one? They would need another one. They would need another Mirage Gate. And there's no energy in there. Where's all the... They would need another, another water. They would need another Mirage Gate. Maybe they don't have it. This is crazy. This, 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 this turn is taking forever. And they just pass! Oh, oh yeah. Oh, and I got it. Boom. Okay, boom. We are going to, oh, we're doing this. And we're going to Artisan. We're going to Artisan for a Natu. No, we're going to Artisan for a Manaphy. <laughs> Forget it. We have a Zatu. We are good. All right. So we're going to, we're going to restart first or Hand Trimmer? No, we're going to Hand Trimmer. Hand Trimmer. Boom. Bye-bye. Four cards. We are going to hand trimmer. You can only keep five. Then we're going to restart for two and then Zatu. Onto the Espathra. Oh, they've got to make decisions now, baby. And there they go. They got rid of Cram. A Colrus? All right. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to attach. Because one, two, three, four. All right. I, I am short, but we're going to restart now. And we're going to see what happens here. Cool. Put down another Natu. Uh... I can Clairvoyant Sense now onto this Espathra. Boom. <laughs> and I found my Eerie. Eerie away, a Mirage Gate, and a Super Rod. We just hand trimmered Eerie them down to three. Yes, I'm only hitting for 120, but you just got rid of a Mirage Gate. All right, so there's one Mirage Gate. There's two more. They only have one more Mirage Gate left. And I, I did not get the 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 knockout, but we hand trimmered Eerie on the same turn. That was fantastic. Uh, okay, so they're gonna uh, do. I have any? I have no energy, so I can't use the retrieval. Uh, they they got to build up their hand again. Um, fortunately, we only played one hand trimmer, because uh, but but it worked with 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 an Eerie. That was awesome. That was seriously awesome. And Jet, they're gonna Jet onto that, so they're gonna be able to do another one. There's their attachment of return. They only have one Mirage Gate left. It would be awesome if they prized it. We haven't seen it yet. There's another buddy buddy. Okay, come on. Let's... Oh, and we had a Spothra. I just realized last turn, even if they had the Mirage Gate, uh, they would have needed four energy. I just realized that. So even the, the Mirage Gate wouldn't have helped them. 
Maybe that's why they didn't play it. All right, good. You can get rid of Manaphy. Sure. All right, we'll just have to attach to Manaphy and, and retreat. Uh, so we'll attach to Manaphy. We will retreat. Come up with this Espathra. I can restart for one. Just nest ball, fine. I can energy retrieval that energy back. Get it onto Espathra. Or do I want to put it on onto... Yeah, all right. Like, come on, give me an energy or a vessel. Nice, another Zatu. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna do this because we are getting the knockout. Boom. Uh, can't play any card, so we're gonna take the knockout here. And yeah, that's right. They had to. Greninja would have needed extra um, extra energy. They would have needed more than three. All right, so there's the Espathor. We don't really need it. We've got a bunch of cards that we can get rid of. Uh, I'm really set up. All I need now is energy. I just need energy. There's six more in the deck. We need to find them. Because that'll give me 12 more cards on top of it. So we either need an Earthen Vessel, an Arvin. All right, come on. They're going to Artisan for nothing. And they're going to conceal cards. They're down to eight cards in deck. And I know they're down a Super Rod. They're down three Mirage Gates. They're going to Nest Ball for nothing. Yeah, all they can do is attach energy now. And we're, we're just going to keep taking knockouts. There's the Super Rod, so they're going to put some energy back. How many energy are in there? Nine? There's nine energy. I'm going to assume they're going to put all energy back in. Look at the timer. All right, energy, energy, cram. Look at the timer. They're down to 14 and change. I've only been played for three minutes. Just over three minutes. Flower selecting. And here we go. What they get rid of there? A Pokey Gear. Well, yeah, they only have nine cards in deck, and you just put... They're, they're going to try to find their cram. They found it. All right, so they found the cram on there. They're going to counter catcher. What are you going to counter catcher? Probably one of my Zatus. Yep, makes sense. Uh, one, two, three, four. All right, so I have to come up with the one that doesn't have energy so I can hit hit their cram. I mean, the one that has three energy. The one that doesn't have the rigid band. All right, so I can build this one up. All right, my turn. Here we go. All right, so let's... Um, Let's nest ball just to see what's in there. Do, do, do I put, I put Jirachi down actually. Yeah. Let's put Jirachi down and let's put, let's put a spa throw, get three energy. Iono. I don't think I own, I own yet. Uh, let's start putting it on Mew. Mew. No, let's put it on the other spa throw. Do I want to Iono? I don't think so. Not yet. Let's hit this for 120. Take another prize card. Cool. All right, so we have Jirachi and Manaphy down. And we have another Iono. So we can Iono, but then the other Iono goes down to the deck. Now I kind of wish I did, because I would have gotten another one. I kind of want to wait till they have like three entered, three prize cards left. All right, so they got Comfy. So they're going to Comfy. Flower Select. And they're, what are they going to What are they gonna put in? What do they got? They got rid of something. They, they got rid of a Colrus. Well, I mean, you can't Colrus. You're going to get rid of five cards. How many cards in the Lost Zone? 13. How many cards in the discard? 23. Yeah, I don't think they have anything. I, I only, I'm going to take a prize every turn here. I really need a boss. Maybe I should have Ionoed to get a boss. They're going to Artisan probably for nothing. Maybe uh, the Sableye. But even that, they, they only have one Mirage Gate left. Could be prized. And they just could see they totally ran out of resources. That worked to a T. Hand Trimmer Eerie. Awesome combo. Future box. Okay, sweet. Uh, we have a, a perfect start here. Uh, we've got a not... Well, I wouldn't say perfect. Because uh, the Natu is going to go away. But I'm going to be able to get a Buddy Poffin plus a, an Ultra Ball. I have the Evolution already, which means I can go get a Rigid Band. And okay, here we go. All right, so they got a Techno Radar. Let's see what they got. And I already have some energy. So I'm, I'm looking good. Um, the problem is uh, my Natu here is is going to go bye bye Right? Um, so I'm going to have basically an Espathra, a, a Zatu already, plus... Oh, they whiffed on the generator. Sweet. They're going to put the booster capsule. Are they going to use it? No, they're not going to use it yet. It wouldn't matter. I'm not, I'm not attacking on turn one. Oh, and I did get an Earthen Vessel. All right, so let, there we go. Let's go see what's in the deck here. Uh, Buddy Poffin, and we'll go get a Rigid Band. Okay, 
Well, it's Buddy Poffin, Flittle, and a Natu. Got one of each. And then we will Nest Ball for... Uh, do I get Mew now? I do have another... Um, let's get another Natu. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Um, we can go get rid of an energy. Go get a couple more. Here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, so now we got to make sure we put the energy on. Natu, put that there. Put this on the Flittle. And now we can do the evolution. One, two, Zatu and Espathra ready to go. Perfect. So, um, they're going to hit for, yeah, they're going to hit me out, which is fine. Um, because now, uh, oh, I should have gotten a flittle. Oh, I should have gotten a flittle. Because now I'm going to have to attach to the not to. Okay. Let's see. I could, I could go get an Arvin for an Ultra Ball, right? I can Arvin for an Ultra Ball at some point. Not right away. Because we're going to get at least three cards. And then I'm going to have to attach to the not to and get some more cards. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's uh, just see what happens. They're going to Arvin for... Electric generator. Yep. No. Oh, they must have one. Why aren't you going to... You're going to try to get more Pokemon out? You're knocking me out. Okay, so they have a Techno Radar. Ooh, you know what would be good? An Eerie. We can get rid of it since you just got it early. And maybe they have a... Uh, I wouldn't say they would have a generator because they just accelerated energy. Oh, they do have an Iron Leaves though. All right. So let's put up this for now. We won't do the attachment for turn. But let's see what happens. Clairvoyance Sense. Once they let me do it. Okay, onto the Espothor. So at least I can do an attack. I got a Flittle and Ultra Ball. All right, let's Ultra Ball these two away. Go get another Zatu. Because then I can go get two more cards. I can still get a Nest Ball with the Arvin. Um, Clairvoyant Sense. And actually with the Arvin, I might have to get another Earthen Vessel. Let's see. Tulip. Tulip will get me two energy, and I can also buddy pot, and I can get these, yeah, which would act like a buddy poffin. So let's tulip, get these two, get these two, and now the tulip's in there, perfect. So get another flittle, another natu, I can attach to here, I can retreat, and I take the knockout right here for 120. And they, even if they attach, all they can do is use the first attack. Okay. And we got a couple energy. Couples. Of, okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. And Arvid could go get me some more uh, energy with an earthen vessel or a nest ball for Mew. And then maybe we can copy an attack. Yeah, we're good. All right. So let's, let's see, um, see what they got here. All right. So there's the attachment, but you can't amp. They have to use arm press. Uh, which is going to be 180. They can hit, which is actually only going to be 150 because I got the Ridge Band. So we're good. We're not going to get knocked out. And then there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we only need to attach one energy, which we have. We're taking the knockout on Iron Hands. All right. So they're going to Arvin again, which is fine. So they're going to knock the Espothra for a little bit. And then we're going to knock out the Iron Hands. Okay. They're going to Prime Catcher. Fair. So they're going to try to take a knockout and they're going to amp, but we're still getting two cards. And right now it's five, five. So they're going to take two cards and we're going to get two cards. Are they going to find a heavy baton? All right. Iron bundle. Now iron bundle. I will give you a not to a few iron bundle. That'll even be better. Hyper blower. Sure. Take, take the not to. Yes. They're going to, now they're going to amp. So they're going to take two prizes with the heavy baton. Which is fine. Really doesn't bother me, I don't think. Because the Iron Bundle is gone. They only have two cards in hand. Amp you very much. I mean, this is not a bad play for them. Uh, but the problem is you're still two-shotting a Spother no matter how you cut it. And I get to one-shot you. Um, right, because I think I'm hitting for 210 now. I'm going to add the energy. Oh my god, we got another energy? Yeah. I'm going to add the energy before I forget. And now we're going to Zatu. Clairvoyant sense onto this flittle. Start loading this up. Eerie. 
Oh yeah, we're gonna wait for that. We are so gonna wait. We're gonna. Oh, do we do it now? I think we do it now because they did get two prize cards, right? I don't want to. I own. I'm gonna eerie because there's nothing else I really need at the moment. I can get everything off later. And oh, we got the prime catcher. What else I got in their hands? All right, Arvin. All right, so you can't prime catcher anymore. I don't need the evolution. I don't need the buddy buddy. Uh, yeah, let's just uh take hit it for 240. Boom. And there you go. You're going to get another one. Yes. And the good thing is, after they take the next prize, we Iono. And we know future that they're they're done if you Iono them down to one. Artisan and another Eerie. All right. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to Iono. I'm going to Iono. Uh, we'll get three, which I think we should survive. Ugh. I do need, I need another energy on Flittle and I need the an Aspothra because I don't know where the other one is because I haven't been inside my deck. Uh, w without an energy, they can't attack. Lost Vacuum, which is actually okay because you're, you're still going to two shot. They can't hit 260. Arvin. All right. So that is, they still need an energy. Okay. They're, they, they, they got the radar. Okay, they're getting a radar, so they would need five. They would need five, so they need all four crown and that capsule. And all right, so there's three plus the capsule. They have nothing else, so they can't get it. And they can't attack. They only have three energy. <laughs> all right, uh, at this point, we boss and go for the knockout for the win here. Um, yeah, I don't think they realize they can't attack. They need the... Oh, okay. All right, they're still short, though. They are still short. Arm press. 220 and we're going to take the knockout. Uh they have nothing behind it. We we are going to we're going to clairvoyant sense. We are not going to Iono. We can't eerie. Uh yeah, we're going to Arvin or here. We're going to yeah, we're going to super rod the other one back in. That was great win. All right. So Arceus with Lux Ray and apparently we took three mulligans. I, I have no idea how. But but we but we did. But uh, we, we, we have a great setup here. Um, I can buddy puff and get, that'll get me three total. And then I can get that down, that down. The nest ball can get the Mew. So I can charge back up to three and then we'll take it from there. So it's actually, uh, it's not bad. Slacking. Okay. Double turbo on the Arceus. You know, that's going to happen. The good thing is that they need a lot of energy. All right. So I could duel up, but that's for later. All right, so there's a flittle. How come that went down? Okay, there we go. There's a flittle. There's two Natus. Cool. So I got two, two. We're going to place that one there. We're going to place that one there. We're going to put down the Mew. There's the Mew. And then we're going to restart for one. Let's see what we get. Another Nest Ball. What do I want? What do I want? Do I want anything? Um, they're not going to hit the flittle. Fl I'm going to lose a flittle. So let's put the other flittle. All right. So now I have two and two, which is kind of what I really want. And let's evolution one of each of them. One, two. Get the Zatu. Get the Espathra. Okay. So now I've got the Muse, the free retreat. Uh, worst comes to worst, I have to tool up for this one energy. Right? I can leave the flittle for now, um, but I could tool up for the one energy and to attach it to a Spothra. They're going to eerie my super rod. Sure. That is taking a chance. I only had two cards and they attach. They're going to nest stash for one. Are you crazy? They just top deck mode now. They're in top deck mode and they're going to concede. Well, duh. So playing around with this deck, I have moved up the ladder a lot. And I'm almost to Arceus League just by using this one. Let me know what you think. Any changes that we can even make it even better. And I'll see you next time.